20,000, 5,000, 5,000, 5,000, 2,000, 1,000, 10,000, 100,000. So here in Vietnam, you can be millionaire with like $50. <laughs> We're still in Vietnam, today in Da Nang, a very big city with a lot of things to do. 14 kilometers away from downtown Da Nang, we found this group of temples, so pretty. They told us that here we're gonna find a very interesting statue. here in Da Nang, we were in the middle of Da Nang, and this is amazing. They said that here there is a lady Buddha, so we saw it from far away, but now that we came in the temple, it's difficult to find it because it's a big temple, there's a lot of stuff going on here. So it's very picturesque if you come here. So let's go to look for the lady Buddha. Just entering the complex, you can already find some temples and gardens, very nice. The Lady Buddha Da Nang is the tallest Buddha statue in Vietnam, with 67 meters height and a diameter of 35 meters. It's like a 30 floor building. It's really impressive. Inside the Lady Buddha, there are 17 floors and every floor has 21 Buddha statues with different expressions and postures. They didn't let us do pictures inside or film, so sorry for that. I'm really impressed every time we find temples here in Asia. They're all full of nature and peace. It's very, very quiet. It's very respect to everything. It's, it's, it's very nice. It's very nice. I almost forgot. We made some friends outside Lady Buddha. But guys, be careful with your belongings. The most common way of transportation in Vietnam are motorcycles. Here sometimes they come to you offering themselves as taxis. They even offer us to take us both in one motorcycle for like a dollar anywhere we want to go. But that's nothing. It's not unusual to see a whole family in one motorcycle. Vietnam has a lot of natural and cultural heritage named by the UNESCO. We're here for a few days, so for sure we have to go to some of them. And now we're in one of them that is very interesting and it's amazing. It's in the middle of the jungle, temples in the middle of the jungle. And this is called Mison. In the entrance of Mison, you will find these little cars that are gonna get you close to the temples. So the shuttle that leaves you in a certain place where you have to still walk a little bit more to get in the Mison temples. But this is all nature and it's a nice breeze, nice smell, so let's just walk and enjoy it. You'll have to walk like 15 minutes of pure nature and you know what? Really worth it. The Sanctuary of Mison is a group of Hindu temples that were made for the god Shiva and they are a world heritage by UNESCO. These temples were built between the 4th century and the 14th century by the Champa kings. Here they used to make a lot of religious ceremonies for the Champa royalty and also it was a cemetery for the royalty and the national heroes.
it's wet. We were not ready for that, but still, it's amazing. We are enjoying it 100%. And if you come to Vietnam, to Da Nang, you have to come here. Mison is the right place. Mison was the religious center of the Champa community during a lot of generations. Mison is a very beautiful place. It's very sad when you read the history that in the Vietnam War, the Viet Cong were here, so America bombed all of this place, and that's why you can see the temples are all destroyed. They're trying to take care of them and fix them and repairing them, but still it's, it's just sad to think about the war and what happened. The French were here for a long time in Vietnam, a long time before the Vietnam War. So you can see that here in Hanoi, there is a typical dish that is actually a sandwich. And when you see the sandwich that is called banh mi, it's basically a mix of Vietnamese and French. So it's like a kind of a baguette full of delicious things. We have to try it. And we're here in one of the most, most typical places uh, for these kind of sandwiches in Hanoi and it's um, everything is gonna be in the description just let's eat okay. <laughs> and the price of the sandwich is actually it's extremely cheap, it's extremely cheap. you're like gonna see the sandwich and, and then you're gonna see it's one dollar it's less than one dollar it's twenty thousand it's less than one dollar less than one dollar like and it's huge Which I'm not sure what is it, but all combination gives a very good flavor, very good, recommended. Nice. I was concerned about the papaya and the mix, but it's perfect combination, perfect combination. And the sauce of it, it's actually on the top, and then with the warmness of everything, it makes like a special, like kind of a tortilla. It's delicious. Hey guys, don't forget to subscribe, put your comments below, thumbs up, and until next time.